it is very important that it comes from within, that you have a sense of yourself, so that when you walk into an office, you don't go alone. Bring your people with you. Bring everybody who has loved you with you. Today we're going to be talking about communication with self. So my first question is, do you talk to yourself? Yeah, I talk to myself. <laughs> All the time. All the time. All the time. <laughs> Every day. What is that daily conversation like for you? For me, I like to do a lot of affirmations and I like to hype myself up in the mornings, yeah. throughout the day, at lunch, just whenever I need it because life is rough and okay. I gotta be my biggest fan of myself. Yes, um, I kind of just try to prepare myself for the day. If, I, if I'm not feeling good, I try to like, you know, tell people, like I'm like thinking to myself, how am I gonna tell people that I don't really wanna talk today? Mm -hmm. And like that kind of thing. Yeah. Really, especially I talk to myself when it comes to communicating with others, like, did I do something wrong? Should I apologize? Should I do this? Should yeah. I, you know, like, and I start thinking about my values and how I should react in the situation exactly. that's currently going on. Right. When I look in the mirror, I always remember that I have a goal and to stay focused and to stay confident and don't let anybody bring you down. Now, have you felt like you've ignored yourself? Like you either should have done something, should not have done something, and you're like, I know what I should, should I do, but I'm not even gonna listen to that. Yeah. We're all human though, we all make mistakes. Like, uh, I, I might get in trouble for saying this on camera, but for women. Okay. I, I've ignored myself with women. Like, you know damn well <laughs> something ain't right. And you know damn well you don't got no business talking to her. You okay. know damn well she did this which, and this. And she tell you like, nah, you know, da da da. You know what I mean? So you know damn well like, oh, I don't got no business being here, but mm -hmm. but you be there. But like, you, you be but there. You like being there. Okay. Like, you know, so I was like, yo, I got to. It comes with something. Okay. Everything comes with something. Right? You feel like that like impacts you negatively or to an extent. Um I feel like that's one of those things where it's like you do what you can handle. Mm. Like when it does impact you, it's not so bad because like I knew better. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it's not really you're not mad at anybody else, you mad at yourself because like you let this happen. Yeah. You know what I mean? So so I mean obviously it, it, it varies based on the situation. Right. But Why is communicating with oneself important? If you don't know how to communicate with yourself, how can you communicate with others? That right there, that right That's there, <laughs> that right there. I love that. I would definitely agree with you for sure. Because if you don't, you just you just flow through life. Yeah. And you don't really, you don't have no direction. Mm -hmm. Like there's no way to truly be happy if you don't have a metric to, right. to where you at. So like, you know, even like even like therapy and whatnot. Like mm -hmm. I, I was never an advocate of therapy until I went to therapy one time. Right. And she told me a lot about myself. And it wasn't like I was having sickness, or it wasn't like I needed help, but it was like her telling me about myself and communicating with myself made me understand myself better, so I, so, so then I can you know succeed yes. in what I'm trying to do because I know myself. Yes. So if you communicate with yourself, you know yourself, and you know yourself, you know how to move in, in, in certain situations. But if you don't communicate with yourself, you already know yourself, and you're just flowing, and then shit just happens. Yeah, then you, you just then, you, then shit just happens to you, and now your emotions are affected by everything outside of you except right. of you. So you got to communicate with yourself to be in control of yourself. Right. I think a lot of people, a lot of black men, we look at it as, I ain't, I don't need no help. I, don't, I ain't sick. Like, I ain't nothing wrong with me. It's not necessarily nothing wrong with you. But you got to understand you. You know what I mean? To get what you're trying to get. You yeah. know what I mean? It's like we understand the sport of football, we want to know everything, whatever, to, to make a play. Right. But you don't want to understand yourself to make a play. Yeah. You know what I mean? Uh...